Okay, the company Rabbit has just unveiled a demo for their latest AI-powered device, and it's truly astounding, without any exaggeration. The launch has definitely turned heads in both the industry and among consumers, especially considering that before they dropped that viral demo, we practically knew nothing about it. You see, Rabbit is aiming to change the game with a device that's really an all-rounder. It does everything by itself, no need for any external apps or add-ons. So, let's watch this demo, folks. It's bound to leave you amazed. Just press and hold the button and talk, like a walkie-talkie. Now, let's give it a shot. What's the nature of the reality? The nature of reality is a topic that has captivated the minds of philosophers and thinkers throughout history. According to Bertrand Russell, reality is composed of hard data derived from sensory experiences and logical analysis. It is the amalgamation of our perceptions, thoughts, and the external world. I can speak or type with R1. If you shake R1, a keyboard will pop up. You will also know that the response speed is much faster than using some of the LLM Assistant apps with web browsing, such as ChatGPT. What's the stock price of Coca-Cola? Searching for the stock price of Coca-Cola. The stock price of Coca-Cola, KO, is $59.76. Who played the role Oppenheimer in Christopher Nolan's latest movies? In Christopher Nolan's most recent film, Oppenheimer, the role of J. Robert Oppenheimer is played by Killian Murphy. The film is a biographical thriller that explores the story of American scientist J. Robert Oppenheimer and his involvement in the development of the atomic bomb. Okay, folks, as you've just seen, this device is simply fantastic. The concept of consolidating every app and service into a single device, entirely managed by AI and conveniently controlled through voice commands, is the future. By the way, this aligns perfectly with one of Bill Gates' predictions that we discussed in one of our previous videos, so make sure to check that out later. Okay, let's take a closer look at R1. Packed with features, it stands out as a strong standalone mobile device. With its natural language processing, touchscreen, push to talk button, microphone, speakers, and 360 degree rotation camera, the Rabbit R1 is a powerhouse. What sets it apart is its capability to connect to the global 4G LTE network, ensuring swift responses. This device doesn't just understand your voice or text. It responds quickly and efficiently, with response times that are significantly better than other competing large language models. Additionally, the Rabbit R1 can engage with diverse applications through the Rabbit Hole web portal, expanding its versatility. Don't worry, folks, this device places a strong emphasis on privacy. It distinguishes itself by not storing any third party credentials, showing a commitment to keeping user information secure. This commitment to both speed and privacy positions the Rabbit R1 as a distinctive and reliable choice in the realm of AI assistant devices. What's even more remarkable is the price tag, only $199. It really goes beyond my expectations and it's remarkably affordable. Honestly, I think I'm going to order one of these. <laughs> I swear, this is not a sponsored video. Rabbit Revolutionary New AI Hi everyone, my name is Jesse, and I'm the founder and CEO of Rabbit. I'm so excited to be here today to present you two things we've been working on. A revolutionary new foundation model and a groundbreaking consumer mobile device powered by it. Our mission is to create the simplest computer, something so intuitive that you don't need to learn how to use it. The best way to achieve this is to break away from app-based operating system currently used by smartphones. Now, Rabbit has introduced a groundbreaking AI framework named the Large Action Model to drive the device operating system. Unlike large language models, such as the ones behind tools like ChatGPT that face issues in translating information into real-world actions, Rabbit's LAM, or LAM, is uniquely trained on graphical user interfaces like websites and apps. This allows it to understand and navigate interfaces designed for humans, enabling it to take actions on behalf of users more efficiently. 
It's a significant leap forward in making AI more practical and useful in everyday scenarios. While models like ChatGBT excel at grasping your intentions and understanding language, there's room for improvement when it comes to carrying out actions. The large action model steps in to bridge this gap. It not only comprehends what you're saying, but actively accomplishes tasks, turning intentions into real-world actions. It's about enhancing the practicality and effectiveness of AI in executing the things you want to get done. Thanks, Lam. The Rabbit R1 can examine visual interfaces and imitate human actions. This means it can perform a variety of tasks, like booking flights, ordering food, creating calendar events, and even controlling smart home devices. During the demonstration, I was genuinely amazed at how effortlessly the R1 managed complex, multi-step tasks. The Rabbit R1's hardware is a work of art, crafted in collaboration with Teenage Engineering. It features a sleek design and includes a touchscreen, camera, and a unique rotary wheel for easily scrolling through results. What's particularly handy is the push to talk button, which instantly wakes up the device, eliminating the need for a specific wake word. This thoughtful design enhances the user experience, making the Rabbit R1 both stylish and practical. The R1 could understand and handle the whole process just by listening to natural language. The large action model knows how to use apps and services for you. This is way ahead of what Siri or Alexa can do right now. R1 and computer vision. It comes with a touch screen, a push to talk button, and an analog scroll wheel, a microphone and speakers, and a computer vision enabled 360 degree rotational camera we call the rabbit eye. The R1 has a super cool feature called Rabbit Eye, and it's a total game changer. With its built-in camera, this device can look at what's around it, recognize objects and text, and then do things based on what it sees. It's like having a smart set of eyes that can understand the world in real time. In their demonstration, the presenter displayed a table of job candidates and requested the R1 to add a new column with certain specific criteria. Surprisingly, within seconds, the R1 not only analyzed the table, but also sent an updated version through email. This blend of visual intelligence and the LAM framework opens the door to some genuinely amazing applications. It's the sort of capability you might anticipate in the future, but here it is today in a consumer device that costs just $199. Quite impressive. Now, let's talk about Teach Mode. It kind of shocked me. It lets users effortlessly teach the R1 new skills by simply showing them how it's done. In the demo, the presenter went through creating an image prompt on the Midjourney AI art platform. They explained each step as they did it, and that tutorial was sent to the R1. Right away, the presenter could ask the assistant to generate new images using Midjourney all without any extra programming. It's a mind-blowing way to empower users to expand the R1's abilities without getting into complex coding. Teach Mode is a total game changer. It lets anyone, regardless of technical know-how, personalize the R1 and make it do more things. You have the freedom to customize it as you wish, making it a unique and groundbreaking feature in the industry. Even though we're in the early stages, devices like the Rabbit R1 demonstrate that the technology for genuine AI assistance is advancing rapidly. In just a few years, I anticipate that using a regular smartphone will seem as outdated as sticking with a flip phone did after the first iPhones were introduced. But what do you think? Will it really be like this, or is it just hype? Are we actually seeing the future, or are we just tumbling down a rabbit hole? Oh, and as always, subscribe to the channel and like the video if you found this information valuable. You take care, folks. See you next time.